I, on the woodpecker today, I move my clamp rack in my new shop. You might remember that last December I moved my old shop into the new one. And since that day, most of my clamps are still on the floor near my workbench. Maybe you also remember that almost four years ago, in my first episode, I built a clamp rack. And yes, it's still in the same place, alone in the old shop, with a couple of clamps. Those ones are not used very often. It's time to get all those clamps off the floor. The first thing I do is to remove the first two sections of the rack. Unscrew the rack from the wall and bring it inside the shop. This is the place where I want to install it. But I have a small problem. I want the rail which supports the clamps to be at the same height as the 2x6s inside my wall. So, I put it where it should be and mark where I need to cut the rack. Then I cut some scrap wood to modify the back of the rack. All those pieces will be glued behind the rack to clear the brace. After marking the brace placement, I cut all the back strips. This is how everything will fit together. But the actual rack is varnished. So, instead of sanding it to glue the new pieces, I use epoxy thickened with silica powder. I spread glue on the rack and screw the new pieces on top. While the glue is still wet, I wipe off the excess. I do the same thing for all the pieces. I leave that alone for 24 hours. The next morning, I brush a coat of shellac on the new wood, just like I did when I built it. A couple of hours later, I can varnish what needs to be varnished. The next morning, it's dry enough to fix it in place. But I have a small problem. The 6-inch screws that I want to use are not long enough. I fear they won't grab the 2x6 strongly enough. So I drill some shallow holes, the same size as the screw head. To avoid potential problems, I drill pilot holes for the screws. Now I can screw it to the wall. With the new pieces I glued on, this can only go in one place. I screw two 6-inch screws at the top. Two lower down. And two more on the clamp support rail itself. With six 6 inch screws, I don't think this will move one bit.
Now I have to put the rack back together. And it's finally ready to hold all my clamps, which are still lying on the ground. When I'm done, I have no more space for those clamps. Oh well, I guess I'll just bring them to the cottage. But the most exciting thing is that I can sweep the floor where all those clamps were lying around. Now I'm glad that all my clamps are at arm's reach. It will be useful for future episodes of The Woodpecker. Yeah.